Did you hate last year's epic collapse? Did you want to die after finishing under 500 yet again? Don't worry, because you now have 400 million reasons not to! It's the slow winter of discontent in the city of brotherly love. Ownership and the fanbase alike has grown impatient with the stench of ruin tomorrow, Jr. A new mark has to be made. The shopping spree would begin. Let's set ourselves up in the reliever aisle with David Robertson. The former MVP section for a little Andrew McCutcheon. Here's the West Coast Island for a nice Gene Segura. The Miami liquidation got them this mint condition nope. JT Real Muto, but they need icing on the cake. Something to assert themselves. <gasps> oh my god, that's it. Bryce Harper, the face of their revival. What's the price tag here? An extra crack of the Liberty Bell? Fine, it's worth it. The time is theirs to secure the NL East. Please? Unfortunately, this is why you now have 400 million reasons to die. David Robertson gets injured in April, never returns. Andrew McCutcheon ended up getting recalled due to a torn ACL. Thank Gene Segura for not running out of pop-up. Jake Arrieta's not only alleged a PED usage in a past life, he's also alleged of not being a pitcher. Michael Franco shows up, like, once every 10 games. Odebel Herrera decided the only thing he liked hitting are women. Reese Hoskins just doesn't like hitting anything. Remember how much Hector Neris sucked? Good news, he's your best reliever and still sketchy as hell. Gabe Kapler too smart for his own good. Or at least you would think. Hiring a pitching coach with no experience coaching pitchers. Bullpen and lineup management done to the logic of your computer overlords. This apparently includes giving a regular role to Sean Rodriguez. The computer's AI is probably Charlie Manuel. By the way, say hi to your new hitting coach. As for the Golden Goose, Bryce Harper? Well, he's all right. Decent numbers, not a total liability on the field. Here's the problem. You don't pay $330 million for all right. Dude only had about two clutch hits all year. Here's one of them. Let's take a live look at Philly's management reacting to this team's destruction. This is why you don't forget about the pitching when making those moves. Fourth place in the NL East. A bitter disappointment of a season. Even better, there's still a good chance they won't finish over 500. Want to not suck the life out of your fans? How about not losing to Miami so frequently? Look out, here comes the anti-clutch! We're as disappointed as you are, JT. We can only hope people are fired, but probably not. Tune in next year when the Phillies learn absolutely nothing and throw a shitload of money at Garrett Cole and Anthony Rendon. And then see someone like Carlos Santana return to form on a different team. I mean, it's not a Philly issue. Ball, base hit! Haggerty to third, he's being waved around. Dickerson makes the throw to the plate. Not in time, the Mets have the lead! Oh, wait, it is.